Well, as we wrap up Women's History Month, today we're highlighting Houstonian Kim Gagne. She's a fierce pioneering force in the television industry who has been the brains behind producing some of your favorite reality and court TV shows. CW39's Paige Hubbard is sharing how the mother, wife, and businesswoman made her climb to the top. According to my zip code, I probably wasn't destined to have the career and what I did have. The story of Kim Gagne begins in Fifth Ward, where she grew up on Dabney Street as a young girl. At an early age, she always knew she was destined for greatness. I absolutely knew, and I can tell you without a shadow of a doubt, I knew probably by fifth grade that I was going to be in television. Kim's interest in television was sparked after one of Houston's first black news anchors, Napoleon Johnson, visited her school. Inspired by his career, she decided to attend Jack Gates High School, immersing herself in the world of radio, television, and film. Recorded in front of a live studio audience. A pivotal moment happened when Kim enrolled at the University of St. Thomas. There, she met a pro meek who became Kim's mentor and gave the young journalist her first big shot. April worked at Fox 26. April had me doing internships. And when I graduated, I got on a job. I went and did a little radio first, but then I circled back and I got hired at Fox 26. And that really was the beginning of my television journey. After leaving Fox 26, Kim got an opportunity to work at KHOU 11 News. There she helped create Great Day Houston, which is still on air to this day. Conquering the world of local television, Kim left her roots in Houston and journeyed to work in Los Angeles, Atlanta, and Chicago. During her time in the Windy City, she became the executive producer of The Steve Harvey Show, winning two daytime Emmy Awards. I really have to give credit to my husband because he really pushed me out of the nest because I did not want to go. After several successful seasons of working on The Steve Harvey Show, Kim returned to Houston, began her own business, and became an author. Not letting where she came from deter her from where she was going. She hopes her story can inspire others to dream big, no matter the circumstances. Pushed by maybe family, or you not being nurtured by family. You can nurture yourself, push yourself, believe in yourself and believe in God, and you can, you can make it work. And those words are so true. In fact, Kim was named one of Houston's top 30 influential women on top of being awarded congressional honors. She also received a proclamation declaring May 16th Kim Gagne Day here in the city of Houston. Congratulations for all that she does and who she is. A true, incredible woman who represents so much. And we have her story online, CW39.com. We'll be right back.